I've been doing extensive research on the internet. Reading theories. Um. Well, theories, articles, um. I went on Tumblr, I even went to Wikipedia, but I didn't stay on there long. Is Moriarty in the BB show Sherlock still alive? I'd like to think so. I was doing lots of research. I even went to uh I went to talk to my dad about uh like he grew up watching the um grew up watching a different Sherlock Holmes show. And uh, so I had talked to him, would Moriarty ever kill himself? And my dad said he would make it look like he killed himself. So that's one point as to why Moriarty is still alive. Calling this segment the Rich Theories or the Rich Man Theorizes. I'll, I don't know, I'll come up with a title later. Um, so right there. Moriarty, it's uncharacteristic of Moriarty to shoot himself in the head. So there's that point. Um, another point is, uh, what else was I going to say? He kept saying, I owe you a fall. Which means he would have to know where Sherlock would want to meet him. And how would he know where Sherlock would want to meet him unless he knew what was going to happen already? I know it could be, mean something else. Metaphorical fall. But he, uh... He kept saying, I owe you a fall. Like, fall. Like, he was going to jump or something. I don't know. It seemed a little too, uh. Um. Just kept saying, I owe you a fall. Kept saying fall over and over. And then there's the, um, I owe you. That was never really explained. I owe you. What does that mean? I've read a bunch of theories on the internet. I was gonna have Sherlock playing music, music playing in the background, but decided not to do that for copyright reasons. Anyways, my big question is: Did Moriarty really kill himself? Because as everyone who has seen, um. All three seasons. Spoilers if you haven't. At the end of uh, his last vow, he, um, just as the credits were about to start playing, showed another scene where Moriarty was appearing on all the screens in London, and uh, it was him saying, in the voice, computerized voice saying, Did you miss me? Did you miss me? Did you miss me? Over and over. Um, And then there's the, uh, now Stephen Moffat, the, uh, showrunner for Sherlock, did go out in public and say, uh, that this was just an extra little bit for the fans and Easter egg thing, uh, Moriarty actually appearing at the end of the credits, like, turning to the camera and actually saying, did you, uh, did you actually saying, miss me? But, then again... Stephen Moffat has lied before about things that are going to appear in a show. Example, Missy, the mistress, the master, wouldn't be returning. The master would not be in season 8. We're not going to have the master coming anytime soon. Master was the main villain of season 8 of Doctor Who. Okay, he lies about these things all the time. So, uh... Chances are... Moriarty is back. Moriarty, master. Huh. That's odd. Anyways. And then... 
something else that doesn't make sense to me is if Moriarty is supposed to be pretty much just as clever as Sherlock, why wouldn't he why would he have other people um help him break into these places all at the same time? At the beginning of the Ruckenberg Fall. Uh, I think I pronounced that right. I'm not going to look it up to see if I got it right, because I'm lazy like that. I've been doing enough research, I don't think I need to do any more research. I, I clearly have a tab up. Moriarty, Sherlock Moriarty's still alive. Anyways, <clears throat> um, what was I saying? Why would the brilliant Moriarty have a bunch of other people help him when he could clearly think of a way to break into all these places himself and then call Sherlock ordinary? No, 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 you're ordinary. At the end of, uh, just before he said you got to kill yourself, um, he kept saying Sherlock so ordinary and that it was too easy to fool him. And why would Sherlock not be able to deduce these things that Moriarty was about to tell him? So Sherlock lied, I think. And then Moriarty faked his own death. And I have a Skype message. That's embarrassing. Um, I'm actually talking to a friend on uh, about Sherlock right now. And, um... I asked them if they've seen Sherlock, they said no. And I said, all I'm going to say is, did you miss me? Um, one sec. So there's a bunch of evidence pointing to the fact that Moriarty is alive. The big thing being, uh, it's not like Moriarty to kill himself. Plus, another sort of little bit is uh, Moriarty has a brother named James Moriarty. So this James Moriarty, James Moriarty. One is professor, the other is general. Anyways, Moriarty's brother could be the Moriarty that was on the roof. And then there's the other James Professor Moriarty. Professor James Moriarty, that could be the real mastermind. There's a bunch of different theories, but I think that Moriarty is still alive is basically what I'm saying. Comment below what you think. Sorry if I'm getting louder. Comment below what you think! And yes, I'm now part of the, um... Um... fan base that's going to go crazy with the theories. I don't care. Ah, sorry. This is unprofessional of me. Um. What do you think? Is Moriarty still alive or did he kill himself? Again, it doesn't seem like Moriarty to kill himself. Why would he do that unless he didn't? So, I'm trying to like do both at once. Um, what do you think? Did he, uh,. Did he kill himself? I don't think so. Um, comment below what you think, or if you just think I'm some crazy person who, um, <laughs> um, I believe he, um, he's alive. Because, yeah, why would he kill himself? He probably deduced that Sherlock was going to fake his own death. So anyways, comment below what you think. Um, it's 2.11 a.m. and I'm in the middle of playing a game. Um, yeah. And get excited because the Christmas special is at the end of the year. And then they're, the next month after that, they're going to be doing series season series four.
don't know why they call it a series. It's a season. But anyways, comment below what you think. Uh, and good night.